Maybe well, congrats on the film and congrats on the weekend in Galway Film Fair winning best feature film. Thank you. Yeah, I just Very got exciting. that message. Yeah, I was so delighted. I fell asleep because of jet lag. Okay. Did you? I was still awake. So I was, and I, we're staying in rooms that are right next to each other, yeah. so I almost pounded on the wall last night, <laughs> but I decided not to. Yeah, but I was, I was busy anyway, so, asleep busy. So yeah. I've heard that, so you've seen th- the film with different international audiences. Have there been like a difference in how jokes have landed, or have you been surprised that Irish jokes have landed? So far we saw it in America. Yeah. His homeland. Okay. Austin, Texas. Yeah. At South by Southwest. Yeah. And then Galway was the second one. And it is interesting. You'll hear different laughs in different places. Mm-hmm. Uh, you, you can never guess. But it's but also just different. Like if you saw it in two places in America, they'd laugh at different things anyway. So it's it's just interesting. The more you watch it, the more you'll find things that they, oh, you were expecting them to laugh here and they yeah. didn't. And they'll laugh at something that you didn't expect them to laugh at somewhere else. Yeah. There was a shorter way to say that and I didn't find it. <laughs> I think it was, it. yes. yes. You, you, yes. Was your question like, is it, do you get different laughs in, in different, depending on where people are from? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> Got it. I did it. I did it. So well, you've been to Ireland a few times now. Mm-hmm. Have you found your time here? Oh, I love it. I love yeah. it. In fact, when I was, uh, got, a per, uh, What's the word? Proposed. I'm also jet lagged. <laughs> approach. When approach, I was approached yeah, about this yeah. movie, I was already planning on coming here for vacation. Mm-hmm. So it was just perfect. Was, I, 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 this is where I like to come in my free time because I, I just find it so beautiful and charming. So, yeah. And he's been to like the Cliffs of Moher. He's been to lots of different places in Ireland that, you oh, know, yeah. Irish people don't really visit. I drove around my uh, just by myself in this big like twelve person passenger van uh, <laughs> through Donegal for four days. Did you just just looking at every, oh it's so yeah. beautiful? Yeah, and you're pronouncing yeah. it right too, so that's a great start. Yeah, Donegal. Yeah, got yeah. it. <laughs> so a lot of horror films say that while shooting, there's like spooky occurrences on set. Were there any strange occurrences while you were shooting the film? The food. I- the food was not the most kind of spooky. <laughs> I think I think uh, there was always an excuse when people had farts and stuff because they would blame it on something yeah. spooky, but it was yeah. just people flatulence, <laughs> normal crew flatulence. But they were like a ghost farted. We were yeah. in, we were in a, a castle that was yeah. uh, supposedly haunted. Yeah, um, I think that maybe what's the name of it again? I forget. In Offaly, in Tullamore and Offaly. Oh, yeah. And uh, I think there probably was, like, murders in that castle before. Um, but nothing to, like... Although the set was closed off in Prosperous and the little car that, like, my character drives was there, but and it got crashed into, do you remember? Oh, yeah. Which is, like, weird because it was a closed off road and everything but this tractor and trailer just came through anyway and crashed into the car which it was, was like, driven by a person it was it, driven by a it person. was, it was dr- yeah it wasn't driven. like a yeah not <laughs> driving car <laughs> but yeah so the spirit moved the farmer i guess to smash the car up yes okay so that was kind of ooh, horror. <laughs> ah. so speaking of different props and things in the film that ectoplasm that poor Ray Ward mm-hmm. had to eat or spit out repeatedly. What was that made from? I don't know. He yeah, t- like he told us at some point. Was it like tapioca? Yeah, stuff? It, I, I think it was pudding, and like the makeup artist made it, and it was like it's like pudding, and but I don't know what made it shiny. And there was I icing still don't sugar. think it was a pleasant thing. It no, wasn't, no. Yeah. Maybe there was glue in it or something. Yeah, it's the same way that you could. Like when you say it was like a pudding, it sounds great. But if you made yeah. it a, you know, a, a pancake out of plastic and <laughs> bolts, it wouldn't. It would still be a pancake, <laughs> but it'd be gross. And, you and like I think it. Barry, who had to do it, like first he was really like, yeah, yeah, you know, whatever looks the best or whatever. And then by the end he was like, oh, like I think I might be in danger because <laughs> it was so gross. <laughs> and I heard there was a bit of an inspired drink at the Fla. Was there like jelly shots? Yes. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. Were they good or equally bad? Those were pretty good. Well, yeah. I mean, depends on your, yeah. your feelings on jello shots. Vodka in them. Yeah. yeah. 
we drinkers. <laughs> you have to just drink it hard. So props and costume. Yeah. Well, that hairstyle. Where? How did you find inspiration for it? How did you settle on that hairstyle? Uh, oh, character? that that was uh, Mike and Enda, the directors. Uh, that was basically their call. They, I, I just when I heard that I was doing the the movie, I just didn't touch my hair, just let it grow to whatever, and then they had this this uh, weird wig they wanted mm-hmm. me to wear. That was my own mustache, from what I remember. Yeah, that was my own mustache. And then at the very end, <laughs> oh, actually, it's a spoiler. Should I? I shouldn't give. No, there but a, he had to yeah. ch- change his hair. I mean, there's, that doesn't sound that exciting. <laughs> there's this. His crease moves from the middle to the right at the no, end. No, there is a there is a bit of a hair sacrifice <laughs> that I make. That is a spoiler, so I won't say anything. Yeah. But it's it's a it's a bummer. It was a bummer to have to live life with the hairdo I had for the <laughs> bit of time that I did. <laughs> Cliffhanger there. Dumb haircut. <laughs> yeah, it was bad. And also, like, I bad. think the lads gave him a wig to wear for really what could have been your own hair, and then they made him do something to his real hair that was horrifying. <laughs> And, and then he had to live with that because it takes hair like five months to grow back or something. But it looks fine again now. I like shit. Uh, well, never mind. I can't say anything. <laughs> I don't want it to, I don't want to ruin what it is. Okay, so it's a horror film and... It's a comedy. Comedy horror. Horror. Yeah. Car, car, so car. It's a chorus. It's one yeah. of the chorus. <laughs> it's the final chorus. Yeah. So when I think of like scary sentences, the likes of we need to talk, or tell me a joke come to mind. But if you were to pick the scariest sentence in the English language, what would it be? Hmm. Scariest sentence in the English language. You're being deployed. At the moment, I'm reading this book about the Iraq war. So it's maybe not that funny. But like, you're being deployed is really scary, I think, because I that would is, be oh, yeah. bad at it, being a soldier. Oh, yeah. Yes. <clears throat> yeah, I agree with you. What she said. <laughs> This bloody moon better make me bloody rich. Yes. This is a satanic ritual. Satanists. I woke up in the morning. To break the spell, we need ectoplasm. You just have to let the ghost inhabit your body. Like in Ghostbusters. Oh, I haven't read that. The plot thickens. Why does it have to be so unnecessarily gross? Black magic. Uh Uh-huh. Your old girl's got something. Oh, 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 oh,